back to Alina, and today I'm doing kind of a collage of videos for you all. First, I want to update you or ask you some questions on a Christmas slash holiday, you know, series for December, since it is now December 1st. Woo, I love December. Welcome one of my favorite months of the year. Actually, I kind of like every month. Like, if you ask me, I would give you a reason why I love every month, but December is one of them because I love Christmas. And anyways, I kind of want to do something like Vlogmas, but obviously... It wouldn't be very exciting for me to vlog every day, and I don't think I could do it. Because I have school every day, seven hours a day, and I don't think it would be all that interesting because I'm not in college, don't live in LA. But I do think it would be cool if I did one vlog every weekend. I took footage from my weekend and put it together, so at least you get, you know, a good maybe five, six, seven minute vlog in there. About what I did in my weekend, I think that would be kind of exciting. What I'm going to call it, I, would, I mean, maybe I'll just kind of end up calling it Vlogmas, but I kind of want to call it like, something with my name. Like, I was thinking of like Anna Claus is coming to town or Anna Claus, but maybe a little cheesy. But you know what? Cheesy is good. Cheesy is great. So let me know what you think about that. And I'm excited to start doing that because I kind of have a busy weekend this weekend. So, anyways, I also wanted to give you somewhat of a, I don't know how many I have one, two, three, four, five, six, six, like a top six, top five, you know, whatever you want to call it. I have. A couple favorites, but I don't want to make it long because everyone on YouTube has been posting their November favorites. And they are like 18 minutes long or 11 minutes long. And as much as I love you YouTubers, I do not have enough time in my day to devote 15 minutes to watching what you've been loving. So I'll make it quick and easy and I'll try to get done all in under 6 minutes. Well, I'll try to be quick. So first thing I'm just going to grab what I see. Really loving lip products. And that is honestly so vague and broad that you're just like, wow, thanks for that really specific favorite, you know, it's like basically an entire category of makeup, but I'm just going to tell you the ones I've been loving because I haven't really been sticking to one, even though none of these are really fall colors or winter colors for the most part, I've just really been liking them nice basic colors, and so I'll start from this side. I have three of the NYX Butter Glosses, one of which, this one, was in my last video, my day to night outfit video, so I have this one, I've had this one for a while, this is Apple Strudel, this kind of nice orangey coral, mostly a coral color. And then I have this one, which is, where are you, Peaches and Cream. And this is like the one I just showed you. It's a little darker, more pinky toned. I like that one. And this is one that I absolutely love. And I told you that it was going to be one of my favorites in the video. And I didn't lie, because this is, and this is Vanilla Cream Pie. It's such a beautiful color. It really does not show up good on camera. Like, I watched the last video. It makes this look like such an ugly color. But you honestly... You just, like, need this in your life. It is amazing. I also have two chubby pencil things. Ooh, don't, don't go sliding up on me there. This is the Neutrogena Moisture Smooth Color Stick in the shade Bright Berry. It just kind of has a little shimmer, but you can't really see. I'm not going to swatch it. I don't have enough time in the day for that. I got this for Christmas last year, and I, I really like it. It's been a good one. It's, it's kind of a more, it's very opaque or opaque, however you say it. So I would definitely not wear this on an everyday basis. And then last for the makeup products slash lip colors. I have the Tarte Energy Lip Surgeon Tint, and I also got this for Christmas. This is a little mini one, and it's, it looks like nothing. It looks like this kind of just nothing color, but when you put it on, it's very minty, which I like, which all the Tarte ones are like that, but it just gives you like a little shimmer, kind of like a little frost, kind of like a MAC luster lipstick would do. I have one of those, but kind of like what that would do. It just leaves your lips feeling nice. Ooh, I knew I was going to forget something. Like, I was running around the house trying to find my couple items, and I forgot this one. I was going to show you this one to you. Probably the most boring favorite, but you know, if you're looking for something like this, here you go. This is the Johnson's Baby Lotion. There's like no uh, scent or anything, it's just literally the baby lotion. Pale pink packaging, you can find it like everywhere. And I've used this, like I've had this used on me since I was a baby. Hence the baby lotion. It's just kind of like a scent, a scent that kind of reminds me of home and I really like it. And I put this on my legs when I get out of the shower, and it smells really good, makes me feel happy, makes me feel cozy. And for me, it smells better than, like, hacking on, like, lots of Bath & Body Works scents on your body. Like, I don't know, just, I'm not a big Christmas scent person on my body, but, you know, spray it all you want. I like that. Just, like, stick with the basics. Fashion favorites, I just have, like, two, and it'll be quick. This first one, I've been really loving the layering, layered, duh, layering or layered necklaces. And I don't really have any, so I can't be like, oh, I'm obsessed with them. But I honestly love this one. It's not really cooperating. Okay, let's get you in line here, buddy. Come on, little buddy. You can't really, I don't even know if it's going to show up. This one's sideways. Not cool. What are you doing? Get your head in the game. But this is from Forever 21, and it has a rhinestone on the top. This kind of bullet target thing in the middle. 
And then this nice black stone on the bottom. I like wearing with the gray shirts. It looks so pretty. And I feel so elegant. Like, I've got so many compliments on that necklace. And then the next couple fashion favorites, you're going to realize how much I've been into comfort this last month. Like, it's unreal. First one, I haven't worn it to school that often. I wear it, you know, as often as you wear a normal outfit. But on the weekend, I probably wear this... Let's say if there's 10 days of the weekend, like even though there's only two, I would say I'd probably wear this for seven of them because it's just perfect. It's this sweatshirt dress. I don't know if I found this in a haul or anything, but it's a sweatshirt that literally just continues on and on into a dress. And it's from H&M I've gotten a while ago, so you probably couldn't find it anymore. And I love it. Like, I'm trying to find more styles like that. I throw on some leggings and you don't need like any seamless underwear. No, 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 because you have this that covers your butt. And uh, it, it's just perfect. Like, I go to the mall, throw that on. I go, it even looks good kind of for church. Mm -hmm. But I love it. I just, it's perfect. Saying pretty quick, pretty simple, fuzzy socks. I haven't really been a firm believer in fuzzy socks. Like, everyone wore fuzzy socks, and I'm just like, just wear normal socks. But then I tried them on, and my world kind of changed. Kind of like, I think Justin Bieber, way back when, tried on Uggs. And he's like, I see, I see how girls wear these. I see how girls wear these, you know? Thank you, soft. <laughs> This may be my last favorite, and you're gonna think I'm so stupid, but I was hungry. <laughs> that was the best intro ever. I was hungry, looking through my pantry for something to eat, and I found SpaghettiOs. I mean, obviously everyone's had these when they were a kid, but I found like a can of these. I made them, and they were so good, and I rediscovered my love. Next time I went to Target, I got like five cans of these. This is one of them. And they're just so good, like so good. And to conclude, here is a little clip of me in my reindeer hat. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Bye! <laughs>